a six times Golden Glove winner and gold medal winner. Coming up. Hello again, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me. As always, my name is Troy Rudder, aka TTM Troy, and I'm so glad that you joined me today. I have some great TTMs for you, including a couple, or at least one, for the set for my 1991 Don Russ set. So that's exciting, at least to me and maybe a couple other people, as well as some great TTMs from retired players that are currently signing and I also have some hockey returns in here for as well. You know, I wasn't quite sure how people would react to the hockey, but there's some people who say, I don't like how the hockey TTMs and there's some people say more hockey TTMs. And so I don't try to get more hockey TTMs or less hockey TTMs. They just kind of keep coming in. So very happy that they do because um, they are some of the best signers. My highest percentage are from retired NHL players, believe it or not. So, hey, let's get straight into the TTMs. Hope you are having a fantastic week as well. So here's the first one right now, boom. All right, speaking of hockey, first we have Brian Hayward. He signed one of one in 102 days via his home in California. Now you can find Brian Hayward's address on Star Tiger. Now, if I can't find a public address for a player, a, I do direct people to the subscription site where I did get that address. And so I do that kind of as a courtesy of the people who do pay for the site and all the people who contribute to those sites, as well as, uh, you know, I want to support those address sites as much as I can. So if you want Brian Hayward's address, you can find him on Star Tiger. Now, he played from 1982 to 1983 for the Winnipeg Jets, the Canadians, the North Stars, and the San Jose Sharks. Now, he actually played hockey in college at Cornell from 78 to 1982. And while he was there, he was an All-American player. Now, he actually went undrafted and joined the Jets in free agency. Currently, he is the analyst for the Anaheim Ducks and does some other games for some other different networks. So very happy to add Mr. Brian Hayward, signed in blue there, to the set. Not really. I do have a set, but anyway, not sure why I said that. Ah, but there you go. All right. Next we have another hockey return, Kelly Miller. He signed two of two in 88 days via his home in Michigan. His address is also on Star Tiger, and this one is for the set because I actually have a lot of these scorecards right here. Now, he played from 1985 to 2000 for the Rangers, the Capitals, and the IHL team, the Grand Rapids Griffins. Now, he was drafted in 1982 at 183rd overall, and after playing, he was actually an assistant coach for the Islanders. So, again, if you want his address, you can find it on Star Tiger, Mr. Kelly Miller. Next, we have a legend, Billy Hatcher. He signed 1 of 1 in 20 days, and I actually sent $5, but he returned it in my envelope and uh, signed for free. So, very happy for that. You can see the address right there, Billy Hatcher. He is a Reds legend and a great signer. Again, I would still include $5 and uh, just to show your appreciation for him signing. Now, he played from 1984 to 1995 for the Cubs, the Astros, the Pirates, the Reds, obviously, the Red Sox, the Phillies, and the Rangers, and was later a coach with the Rays and the Reds. He is a World Series champion with the Reds in 1990, and uh, during his postseason, Hit 519 in 1990. That is pretty darn good. The legend, Billy Hatcher. Next, we have another legend, Robin Ventura. Woo-wee! This was a great return. Now, he signed one of one in 14 days via his home in California. I did not include a donation on this one, but uh, you might want to include a donation with yours. So there you go. His home address is on Star Tiger if you want to send something to Mr. Ventura. Now, he played from 1989 to 2004 for the White Sox, the Mets, the Yankees, and the Dodgers. He is a two times All Star, six times Gold Glove winner, a Golden Spike Award winner, 
and won a medal in the 1988 Seoul Olympics. During his career, he had a batting average of .267 with 294 home runs and 1,182 RBIs. Later in his career, he was the manager of the Chicago White Sox from 2012 to 2016, but he retired after four straight losing seasons, unfortunately. But a great return for the set from Mr. Robin Ventura. Hope you enjoyed that update. Got a couple cards for the set. Now, if you're interested in seeing how I am doing for that 1991 Don Russ set, just go to my website, ttmautograph.com, all one word. And under the menu, you can just pull down cards by set and go to 1991 Don Russ. And I have them all there in order with their numbers, with a picture that you can get close up scans. And any of these autographs that I show on my channel, you can get close up scans right there on the website. I highly recommend you check it out. You could also find the links to my favorite supplies like top loaders and uh, penny sleeves and, and mag cases and even the lights I use here that have been really bright lately. I don't know what's going on <laughs> there. Hopefully you guys aren't blinded by my lack of a tan here <laughs> in the winter or anytime for that matter. But hey, I'm really glad that you took time to uh, watch this video with me today. I really appreciate it. You know, um, I, I was kind of dragging there in December, but now that I'm back in the groove, I really like, um, I, I really enjoy spending the time and just kind of talking to the camera, knowing that, hey, there could be one person there watching or there could be a hundred. Usually I get about 200 per video. Uh, which, you know, in the grand scheme of YouTube isn't a lot, but, uh, you know, you guys, uh, you know, I really appreciate you guys sending in all the, the stuff for the wall. And if I don't do a video saying, hey, everything okay, you know, that's, that's pretty cool. Um, and I've really enjoyed the last, especially the last two or three years, being able to meet more people, whether it's at VidCon or the Nationals, or, um, you know, I went to see people at... Um, a card show, <laughs> you know, in Iowa or just wherever, you know, I really, I hope to get out a lot more <laughs> this year and meet some of you. I won't be going to nationals this year, maybe next year when it's back in Chicago in, in 2021. But, um, you guys have all the fun in, uh, where is it? New Jersey, Atlantic city, something like that, uh, in 2020, but I will have to wait till next year. But I do hope to actually, I didn't get to any baseball games this year except one Iowa Cubs game and it was really cold. So hopefully I'll be able to do that. But hey, this is dragging on for a little while. So I just want to say again, thank you so much. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And may your mailboxes be full and your stamps forever. Bye-bye. Oh,